In today's video, we will talk about whiskey. For many people, whiskey is a simple alcoholic drink made of cereals and aged in oak barrels. They are quite right, but is that true? There are many varieties of whiskey, such as single malt, grain whiskey, single cask, blended whiskey, bourbons, Canadian whiskey, and Japanese whiskey. Just as we put white and red wine in one basket, they are different from each other. The name of the whiskey dates back to 1736, but the water of life was mentioned in the 16th century, and the legend of this drink dates back to the 7th century. In today's episode, we will look at the difference between bourbons and scotch whiskey because they are responsible for 90% of the whiskey sold in the world. Speaking of scotch whiskey, I mean blends such as Johnny Walker, Grants, and single malt whiskey such as Lagavulin, Bowmore, McCallum. Number 1. Ingredients Bourbon is mainly produced from corn, minimum 51%, but usually it is around 70%. The rest of the ingredients are different grains and barley malt. Single malt whiskey is produced only from barley malt, often smoked with a pit smoke within one distillery, while blends are usually made from barley malt and other cereals. Blended whiskey can come from different distilleries. Manufacturers of blends usually do not specify the age of the drink because its components may be formed at different times. Number 2. Origin Bourbon must be produced in the United States. Most of the production, as much as 95%, takes place in the state of Kentucky. Scotch whiskey obviously has to come from Scotland and it cannot leave the country in barrels. This means that the production and the aging of Scotch whiskey must take place in this country. Currently in Scotland there is more than 20 million barrels or 3.2 billion liters of alcohol. Number 3. Oak barrels. Only new barrels are used for aging bourbons. These barrels are fired inside. The barrels are used only once, then they are resold for example to Scotland. For the aging of scotch whiskey, barrels were used before to maturated liquors such as bourbon, wine and sherry. Distilleries are experimenting more and more and you can find the whiskey that has been aged in beer or rum barrels. Number 4. Aging time. Bourbons must be aged in the oak barrels for a minimum of 2 years and everything that is less than 4 years old should have this information on the label. As for scotch whiskey, the minimum maturation period is 3 years. Bourbons mature shorter than scotch whiskey. This is due to the ambient temperature and the maximum temperature amplitude. In America, and especially in Kentucky, it is much warmer than in Scotland. Also, the difference between the maximum and the minimum temperature is much greater, which accelerates the maturation of the whiskey. Number 5. Spelling Whiskey with the letter E comes from America and Ireland, while whiskey without the E is produced in Scotland Canada and Japan. One of the legend says that in the 19th century, Scotch whiskey was considered by the Americans and the Irish as the alcohol of lower quality and they wanted to distinguish themselves from this product. That's all for the quick comparison of bourbon and the Scotch whiskey. Let me know in the comments if you like such videos and would like to see more of them on this channel. If you like the video, please leave the thumbs up and the comment and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.